Welcome to Mission Sunlight. Join the Network 7 Media Missionaries today as we visit the campus of Segundo Adventist College in Valencia, Spain. We're in a very beautiful environment near the Mediterranean Sea, but also in the mountains. We receive students from all over Europe, especially Spain and Portugal, but also students from places in Europe, Central America, North America, and even South America. Our student body is made up of 245 pupils in the primary school. 350 high school students, and 150 in the School of Music. The School of Theology has a program, a BA in Theology, who is four-year work uh, and a master program. Actually, we got two master program, a BA, a master in Theology, and a master in Faith and Science. We got uh, 54 students coming from different places, uh, mainly from Spain, but also from Latin America and from different countries in, in Europe. We mainly serve the church in Spain. We provide pastor for the church in Spain and Portugal. Uh, but many of our students uh, go to work over, over, overseas to other places in Europe, churches in Europe or Spanish churches elsewhere. Even though students come from a variety of cultural backgrounds, they find friendship as well as academic excellence on the campus. I am very happy to be able to study at Segundo. I've learned so much during my four years in the theology school. I'm beginning my fifth year and will be working on my master's degree. I have made so many friends and met so many new people among the students, the teachers, and the community. Everyone is like family to me, and that's one of the reasons why I'm so happy to be here. School leadership is serious about training generations of youth and young adults to share the story of Jesus. We focus on the student's mission. We prepare students to be missionaries, to be preachers, and the whole campus also is involved in different activities with the society. Even the primary school and the secondary school are very connected with the area. From the very beginning of this campus, the School of Theology has different projects to plant churches. Church planting is done in a practical and hands-on method involving students and faculty. We actually planted four new churches in the area from the Union Church. The school has a practice of sending students to all the churches around where they participate every Sabbath, learn how to be a pastor, and help the churches. All the faculty and all the community are involved in this project of working in the churches around here. Another study program at Segunto is Adventist Colleges Abroad, or ACA. Well, the ACA program is an opportunity for students, for, especially from North America, to go all over the world to get the culture and language. Here in Spain, we have run this program since 1968 and in this campus since uh, the 70s. Every year we get around 50 students during the academic year that come and learn the Spanish language and the culture. And in the summer we also have a summer program where they can come and get some credits for their home universities in North America. I found out about the ACA program through the college that I go to in the U.S., which is Pacific Union College. Um, our foreign language professor um, had like a meeting at the beginning of the year that explained what um, ACA was. This program is really, really cool because it gives students the opportunity to travel for a quarter, for the summer, or for a whole year, and get to experience a new culture, learn a new language, at another Adventist school somewhere else in the world besides where they've been studying. Imagine going to a country where you don't know anyone and everyone speaks another language. I honestly really didn't know what to expect when I um, knew I, when I found out I was coming to Spain. I was super, super excited. When I arrived, I was honestly surprised at how big the campus was. I definitely thought it was going to be a lot smaller. It is beautiful. I've had so much fun here, my time. I got to meet so many people. I didn't really know anyone that well when I first came, but over the time I've gotten to know so many of the local people in the area and the students and the other ACA students that have come. Um, the theology students, the high school students. The college campus is large, but the need for new buildings is critical. The project for the, for the offerings is to build a new building for the School of Theology that will be helping not just the student at the, the School of Theology, but also the ACA program. We got a, a building who was built years ago that is under the cafeteria, but it's getting small. And we also 
we got a new program and we, need, we got new requirements from the government. A few years ago, we got the accreditation from the Spanish government to work as a school of theology with an official degree. So that gave us a lot of work to do and the, the needs to create new space to work according the regulation of the state. We need more space to have better classes. This will help both students and faculty in scheduling and organization. In the new building, we will have teaching and we will have space for faculty, for ACA, and for the School of Theology. As a part of the master's degree in faith and science, and for training students to share the Bible, we also hope to build a whole area for creation, especially for children. Uh, the new building that uh, will be constructed in this campus will serve, will be a facility for our students, will be a facility for our program, so that we can welcome more students, we can prepare a laboratory, a, lang a laboratory, a language laboratory, and I'm sure the students will benefit a lot from that uh, new facility. Students are excited about the possibility of expansion on the campus. The new building is important because it will be a place to help us learn and continue to train to be prepared to go out and be a light in the world and to the community all around us. Yeah, I think it would be so cool to have some newer buildings for students to learn and more space for that to take place in. I've loved my classes, absolutely love them. But there have been some, a couple times where there's just not enough space in one room for that many students to be there, and we're just a little bit crowded. This 13th Sabbath, you can make a difference for theology majors and North American-based students attending the ACA program here at Segundo Adventist College in Spain. We wish for you a blessing from the Lord for your help. And not only that you just give to this offering that will help us, but that you will come and see our school and that you will see what your offerings have done in the construction of this building. Thank you everyone so much for giving to the new buildings here at ACA. We greatly appreciate it and can't wait to see what a difference it makes for our school. From here I would like to send every member of our church for the generous donation to this project that will benefit our school and our church and the global church and the mission of our Seventh-day Adventist Church. Thank you very much. On Sabbath, March 28, you can make a difference for the students of Segundo Adventist College. You might not know until heaven what a difference your gift makes. Reporting from the campus of Segundo Adventist College in Valencia, Spain, we are the media missionaries of Network 7 Media Center, uniting the Seventh-day Adventist Church for missions. And this is Mission Sunlight.